double dipping on a Thursday night. Eskimos return home for the first time in a month to face the winless Argos on the road for a third consecutive game as they clash at Commonwealth Stadium. We're underway with Chris Reedy taking that kickoff. Wind at the back of the Argos to start this game in. Reedy will be tackled at the 30 yard line. Cooper to the sidelines, Martise Jackson in, now second and three. Harris through the reeds, anybody home? It's intercepted. It's the middle linebacker, Justin Herpin Reed, all the way back near his goal line, coming up with a takeaway. After review, we have defensive pass interference, Toronto number 14. Ball will be placed at the two yard line, first down, Edmonton. Four, so they knock on the door here, and it's Jack Cooper, fumbles, and the Argos get it again. So a team that's been played by wow. making turnovers gets them on back-to-back -back plays, and this one's going to stick. Some of the issues in the Montreal loss, as you mentioned off the talk, Chris, and last week in the heat, penalty at the wrong time, mistake at the wrong time. Trevor Harris said that they took their turns. Second and eight. Uh, Bethel Thompson. The same page and Money Hunter, easy pickings back into Toronto territory. And off to Cooper, right side got a hole, second level and more down to the 15. Well, there's that burst. They turned it over once inside the five. Second and goal here for Harris. Goal line touchdown. Tavon Smith. After review, we have offensive pass interference. Edmonton. Number 27. Didn't sell it. Will be Edmonton ball. No Oscar for the PI. We're saying it is. And the Eskimos are in for the Challenge. touchdown. Flag on the plate, usually defensive alignment offside. Toronto, number zero. The penalties decline. Touchdown. Up and through. And it's a 10 point Edmonton lead. White's got it. Started the game 212 yards away from 20,000 in his career. Swings this one out. That might be a live football. Yeah, it might be a live football. And the Argos have got it. Cleon Lang comes up with it. Could be ruled a forward pass or not. Well, it, he might be okay there. Well, he fades away from it after he throws it. That's for sure. It's, it's where the ball leaves his hand and where it's... After automatic review of the turnover, the ruling on the field stands. First down, Toronto. Well, they are going to call it a lateral. And take a look at his and feet. Klingon Lang with the fumble recovery. Here is this game number six. Argos moving here, though, and Walker with another catch. And he stays in bounds and gets loose. Darrell Walker with yards after the catch to get the Argos a little closer. In sacks, now up to 22, three on the night. Bethel Thompson in trouble, ball knocked loose, and Usher's got it, and Edmonton gets it back. No way you can be casual and not secure the football here. From the Toronto 35, four receivers near side. Harris looking that way. Tavon Smith to bring it down. Nice catch. And another Edmonton first down at the 11-yard line. Fifth trip to the red zone, one for four on the night, and it is Cooper. To the goal line. He took Micah away the last three or four yards to get there. Second and six. To the near side. Walker's a catch. Did he get a foot down? Third down. Let's take a look. Well, that's a catch. Yeah, I think looks like think. the right foot got down first, and you can see green between the foot and the chalk line. Seven straight against the West, only one Eastern opponent. Brady back, and he'll field that at the five. See what Brady's got. Can he get the edge? He does. There is a flag in behind him, though, and all this likely for nothing. Brady still going. And finally take it out at the Argo bench. Chris Rainey on the return all the way. Illegal block, Toronto number 94. Half the distance to goal. First down. After review, there is no illegal block on the play. Yeah. It will be a Toronto first down on the 54-yard line. Take the Burks. Going to load it up. 
Got Ralph downfield. He can't make the catch. He was in behind coverage. And a point successful. You wonder if we've seen the last of Harris tonight. Up and good from 37. Darrell Walker, four catches, 69 yards. So far, in a return to Commonwealth, and there's a fifth catch and another first down. And Tennessee stay running the ball and 11 touchdowns. Here's Proof Cop again, and this one thrown away. And John Johnson will play center field and bring it down. That helps the stat line. That one, nope. White from 39 yards out. Time to shake things up. Takes a knee. Argos remain winless. And the Eskimos back in the win column and are four and two through the first third of the CFL season.